You guys drinking? Yeah, yeah me too. <laughs> Oh, well, as my daddy always said, the day I came to my job drunk was the day I handed my badge and turned in my gun. <laughs> my daddy was a pilot for American Airlines, <clears throat> based out of Okaboji, Iowa. Nothing? Iowa, go Hawkeyes! I Iowa! <laughs> Thank you, Corn Belt Conference cheerleader. Modeled for a while, and then I started thinking, and they fired me. <laughs> hmm. Mother told me, you can be anything you want to be when you grow up, as long as you put your mind to it. I wanted to be Asian. I don't know if it's going to happen. She's getting on me about that. Christy, why can't you get me some grandkids like your sisters did? So I don't like the taste of tequila. <laughs> Back seat of your station wagon's uncomfortable. Um, I have one sister. She just celebrated her 25th anniversary. <sighs> 25 years. It's a long time being a Catholic nun. Whew. Oh, really? She almost didn't make it, though, because she was caught having an affair with a priest. <laughs> and they're worried about me because I don't go to church. At least I didn't take one from the team. <laughs> And I pray every day for the last two weeks. Please, God, don't let the stick turn blue. <laughs> Heaven forbid if it ever did turn blue, you know, I'd have to go and get that other test just to make sure that the baby was mine. But, uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, do you guys think it's okay to drink when you're pregnant if you're absolutely sure you're going to give the baby up for adoption? <laughs> mm. Good old Sister Bonnie, or as the priest would call her, sister can't resist her. <laughs> she looked good, you know? We knew something was up. She started wearing makeup. She lost all that weight. She was on that uh, Atkins-friendly, low-carb communion wafer. <laughs> I can't believe it's not Christ. God is good. You know how she was caught? She was caught in a confessional. <laughs> Yeah, a jug of the altar wine, Father Murphy, and a string of those anal uh, rosary beads. <laughs> oh my God. Crazy girl. I shouldn't judge, what do I know? Thought I liked dating the older man for a while, and then I realized <laughs> I was just hungry. Uh, I learned a lot from him, though, you know? He's stories he had when he was a kid, like there, how there's this huge flood and there's like two of everything. Uh, a lot of perks to dating the older man, you know? Upfront parking everywhere you go. The discounts. Little games you can play, hide the walker. <laughs> then that guy went crazy. Yeah, he took me on a trip to Las Vegas. He goes, Christy, anybody ever messes with you, I will kill them with my mind. I take orders from the voices. So I started whispering through the vents, bye, Christy Diamonds. <laughs> Give Christy a car. And things got even more whacked. We got back home. I caught him going through my bras and panties. And I got to be honest with you, Kind of tickled. <laughs> <laughs> no, the thing was, he looked better in them than I did. Yeah, he was a little, had a little sugar in the tank. I know. I missed all the signs. Like, we had little names we'd call each other, you know? Like, I'd call him my little sugar pops. <laughs> He'd call me his beard. Uh, tried to break, tried to break up with him. He's old baby. You ever try to break up with me, I'm gonna break your pretty little face. I know, I was like, you think I'm pretty? <laughs> Dear diary. Ah, longest relationship I ever had was uh, two years. That was with Sprint. <laughs> I couldn't even hold on to that. 
Literally, I dropped the cell phone in a porta potty. <laughs> and I'm one of those girls, you know, elbow to the elevator button, I kicked the bathroom door open. That phone went in, I whipped around, ripped the seat off with my bare hands, put all the toilet paper around my arm, I looked like a little Michelin woman, and I, I had to, it had every number I've ever had in it. I went down, pulled it out, uh, wrapped it up in plastic, I went into the Sprint store, I'm all, I don't know what happened. <laughs> Just quit working. And the guy's looking at it, he starts unwrapping, I got that dog eating grass. <laughs> He's looking at it, looks at me, he's all, looks like you got water damage. Are you getting service? <laughs> Talk about customer care. He even tested the battery with his tongue. <laughs> all right. What's that? Christy, before you leave us, please tell us about your experience with that construction worker you saw out on the street. Well, <laughs> since you asked. <laughs> You know what's worse, ladies, than when you go by that construction worker and they're all, oh, baby, shake it, pantalones calientes. Is <laughs> when you go by and they say nothing. <laughs> then you gotta go back. <laughs> you guys have been a lot of fun. I've been Christy McHugh.